Hello, Monsters of Ban here, and welcome back to Total War. War Hammer 3. You're right. You, don't, you shouldn't strain like that. Let it come naturally. And part, <laughs> and part of my Boris Ursus campaign. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Um, well, last time. <laughs> Continue to beat the shit out of Sigfold. Holy balls. Well, that guy just sucks. And we got Doc Trek. Well, yeah. I don't know where Felix has gone. Felix didn't spawn, so we just got Got Trek by himself. And I'm, I'm sure he had, like, an axe, but he doesn't have an axe. Um, and, I mean, I guess that's fine. <laughs> He's not very good, is he? Like... Oh, well. Uh, does he cost us anything? Okay, it doesn't actually cost us any money, so I guess, like, just having him there is fine. And Banjo's recruiting some, some stuff, which is great. Very excited about that. Meanwhile, Pingu, I'm going to send Pingu to see if we can say, in fact, if we maybe go by C. I'm a little bit, because it look. Well, mind you, how do you feel about... Are you... Wait, how do you feel... Um, how, how, how? What? What? How the fuck don't you have diplomatic contact? Get the fuck out of here. I'm screenshotting that. Um, <laughs> fucking what? They're right next to each other. The fuck? Such fucking bullshit. Such bullshit. Look, I... I I get it. I, like, so, okay, so someone said about the whole diplomatic contact thing, like, um, it's to do with, you know, having having some things not resolved before the player gets there, which is, I guess, fine. But when you have two factions right next to each other, I feel like they probably should have diplomatic contact. Yeah? Is, that, is anyone against that? It feels fairly sensible to me. Like, if they're within line of sight of each other, they should have diplomatic contact. Right, you. Come here. Come on. Fight me. Fight me. Alright. I'm, I'm, I'm happy with being sacrificed. Bring it. Okay, that sorcerer could... Potentially be quite nasty. So, we're going to try and take him out first. So Ulrika has been picking him off. We hit with Death Frost as well. He's actually pulled back. I don't think he likes being shot. So Ulrika is going to have to find a gap in the enemy lines to get around behind to try and uh, assassinate him for us. Meanwhile, got our lovely checkerboard pattern there, which means that anyone heading towards our infantry line is going to get uh, a face full of gunfire. And then the bears on the left flank being led by Boris. The Oath Brothers of Tor just protecting our flank from this potential issue. We've got some Seeker Chariots, Chaos Chariots, and some Warhounds as well over there. The Marauder Horsemen trying to get some shots in. But yeah, quickly, quickly being routed. By concentrated gunfire. Ulrika's managed to find that gap and she's now charging towards Varitas. He ain't gonna get close enough to our line to drop any magic on us, which is good. Which will save us some damage. I'm not too worried about stream of corruption. And Boris is moving in to engage the, the enemy sorcerer. Sorcerer Lord to a murder him. Got Sam is fighting off some Chaos Chariots, and the Oath Brothers are fighting off the, uh, the Seeker Chariots, which are dead now because, of course, Demons got sad. And our Bear Boy is just waiting for the chance to tear the Severed Claw to pieces. With two goblins in a trench coat making for Ulrika to help her out because he's a little bit surrounded over there. However, she, she can hold her own. 
Get him, lads. Ooh, lovely charge. There's Chaos Warriors with Hell Scourges. They're getting absolutely wrecked. Death Frost coming out here, but looks like someone wants a hug. Well, you can hug my kitty cat instead. Hug the kitty cat. That's what the kitty cats are good for. Like, you can just... Someone wants a hug? Hug the kitty cat instead. There we go. Job's, job done. Veritas is still alive, but Ulrika has managed to keep him occupied and far away from our front line, which is good. And you can see that the infantry have managed to fight off the main bulk of the enemy army. The demon spew. Get some shots in the bum as a goodbye present. The Severed Claw doing some damage to us, but overall being surrounded and picked off. And then our bear cavalry finally arriving to assist Ulrika who's been keeping the Chaos Sorcerer occupied during the battle. It's like, it's like the kitty hugs too hard. Also, Sam's getting hugs. Not from Mr. Frodo like he wants, but still, a hug is a hug, right? Okay. Good. Don't want the money. How much money do we have? More I'll take that. Boris Ursus himself. Okay, well, there's definitely... Ooh, babushka, babushka. Do we also have the less costs? No, that must have... I thought we had an event last time, but that must have... Uh, must have faded. Never mind. I would... Wouldn't my, you know what? More weapon strength, actually. Make you more killy. Okay, I think with you pretty much dead. I'm going to go for the Silver Tower of Sorcerers. Capture that. And then you've only got the Fortress of the Damned left. Which is probably where you're getting most of your, your nasty shenanigans from. Also, I think these guys only have that one. Oh, if we, ki if we kill that settlement, actually, that will remove all of that threat. That's probably that's probably what we'll do. That's probably the plan. Banjo! Get yeah, Ice Maiden's kit. Do you have uh, has anyone got any bonuses for Ice... Ice Guard? No, you do have the bonuses. You've got better bows. So, Missile Strength. More Missile Strength. How much Missile Strength do we have in this army? 40? Holy fuck! That's... That's a lot of... That's a lot. We've only got 9 armor piercing compared to... Uh, 21. So you're not good against armored targets. But pretty much anything that's uh, even vaguely unarmored will get shredded by the Ice Guard, which is great. Do I want a thingy here? I guess, yes. Because we need the public order, because it's horrible. Uh, I might go with this. Alternatively, hang on. This gives more money, right? 10% income. I feel like we need that. I feel like we need the extra cash. Okay, we're not going to upgrade that because I can't defend it at the moment. So there's no point trying. We'll send Pinguku to go and find the High Elves so we can trade with them. And that will hopefully then give us a little bit of extra income. And we can meet, like, Bretonia. See, see if we can go and meet, like, even Volkmar. Even, even Volkmar. Rapants. All that kind of stuff. If we can, if we can meet up with them, get trade agreements... Like, I don't even need the non-aggression pack. Just the fucking trade agreement. Hello? God, you're really, really into that, aren't you? Did you just replenish your army almost instantly? I 
I mean, I know you can do that. Right, come here. That's it. Run. Run. I don't mind where you... In fact, if I attack the settlement, you'll have to come in and reinforce, won't you? Ha! <laughs> uh, you know, I've spanked you so often, I'm just going to water resolve it. Okay, and now I take it back. You see how that didn't... Oh, Pingo's got a war horse. That's going to help him. That's going to... Well, actually, not unless it's a seahorse, considering he's about to... To land. Lands? No. Go. He's about to embark. That's the one. In, exactly. Uh, do you want to cleanse corruption? It looks like the Empire is... is it, it was doing really well. It's not doing so well anymore. It, it was doing well. Uh, oh, we've got another theme jig. Right, where do I want you? Do we have any four province... Four settlement province? We do... The Cold Myers. Which is... Dear... Can't the, oh the cold Myers is the, oh we don't have the entire province. Uh oh no it's not we've got an event that's what fiscally prudent income yes obviously obviously fucking income come on guys get that shit together obviously we're gonna go income don't be mental. Demon Slayer. So Cliff Richards is fine. We get, we want defences everywhere, also docks, and yes, basically any anywhere we can get more cash. How much money we can trade? Almost 3,000. We would be far worse off without trade. Maybe we can link up with the dwarves, like literally anyone. Hmm. Let's not allow pleasantries to delay more beneficial discussion. Yeah, okay, well, could, could we be friends? I want. I really want. Non, I, want I want a military alliance with you, Xiaoming. Because I really want big Cathay artillery. Send me a champion. Well, you had Felix. I don't know where he's fucked off to, though. Okay, we'll do that. Are you ready to go? Holy shit! Banjo is finally ready to go. It's been so long. I'm wondering where, I mean, because Azizel's currently in the Empire, so do we just like sneak in and take his shit while he's not looking? Because, <laughs> I mean, it, some of it's frozen, which is actually really nice for us. And if we could grab Erengrad, that would be so good. It does mean fighting through Throt, and that's, uh, it, Throt probably has a lot of stuff. Which is a concern. Do I want you to be a mentor? I kind of do. This I serve, Kislev. I kind of do. Uh, let us give you Ice Maiden's Kiss. It's not a spell I tend to use. And yeah, more weapon strength. Do we have any... Right, what do, what do we have here? Right, this is garbage, this is garbage fuse. Talisman of Endurance is pretty good. Great Bear Pal... I don't... Right, if we get Urson's Claw. I don't know what Urson's Claws are like, though. I don't know if they're good or not. Okay. Uh, you have that, because I do tend to... I do tend to, like, throw you... ...into combat. Does this Gabriella do again? More wins of magic power reserve per turn. Character experience. Okay, that's fine. That is fine. I guess a vagabond. I did. Well, I need. I need to get that mod that um that reduces or the 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 mishy mash mod, and then I can make vagabonds kiss and turn into magic items because that's how that works. I think I look. I'll, I'm I'll, I'm just I'm just saying it like I see it. Got trek. I the problem is you're only around for thirty turns. You're only around for 30 turns. Should we do, like, an... Oh, we can't afford it. Let's go do another Ice Switch Lord. Yeah, okay, you just stay there for a minute. Gottrek isn't even that good. Why do they make Gottrek bad? Gottrek, I mean, if he's around for 30 turns, he should be a fucking powerhouse, shouldn't he? He should be able to, like, you know, smash enemy lords to pieces. And instead, he's just a bit shit. It's just weird. 
it, it's like they they made the conscious choice to put Got Track and Felix in the game, and then they just made them bad. And I don't know why. Very odd. Very, very odd. Hear me roar. Okay, let's let's take out the Silver Tower of Sorcerers because that'll stop them from throwing armies at me endlessly. Get in there. Don't you try and shirk off. Right. I'll take that one. Thank you very much. We got... Ooh. Hello. Hello. Big money. Big money fucking prizes. Yes, please. Yes, please. And I'll, I'll put a church in there as well. Okay, if we can come down here, wipe these guys out. Oh, well, you say that. Now, who... Right. Siggers. Where are you, you piece of shit? Fool. Have you got... Wait, where have you... Oh, you've got that settlement as well. Oh, you bastard. No, so you still have those two guys as vassals, which suggests that this, this settlement didn't give you... Didn't give you control over them. Oh, well, never mind. Oh, God. So much territory. <laughs> can't defend it. I, I can't defend it. I've got nothing. At least, you know what? We're making enough money that it's that it's generally fine. If we just if we just slap defenses in all of these. I genuinely think we'll be mostly fine. Like, if they hit us with a couple of stacks, then, yeah, obviously. Oh, Catherine's going for it. Come on, Karen. Okay, would you do that if I declared war against those guys? Okay, what about if I declared war against both of them? Really? Really, Catherine? Really? We've got Raid Cracker Drac. I mean, that's not going to happen. Or eliminate one of these guys. Well, that's almost certainly going to happen. Or is it? Because they're quite far away. Okay, well, I won't worry about it too much. Praise or sack a set? Right, if, so we could get actually a bunch of diplomatic relations with um, with Kislev. Just by beating up one of those guys. So we probably should actually, because that would actually that would that would give us enough for a military alliance. Which would be useful. Two goblins in a trench coat, you're getting a mentor. And I guess to be honest, at that point, you're kinda of like, let's just tick you and you can do your own thing. Orson's disciple. Let's just do that. Uh oh Boris had one. I follow the bear. Yeah, I know you do, mate. You're very, very insistent on telling me that you follow the bear. We could get Grand Builder? I'll tell you what, if we do Excellent. that... So this... If we unbuild that and then build that, that's going to be a lot cheaper, isn't it? Boris Orsos. Okay, I guess it's good for, like, setting up settlements and stuff. Okay, no, no qualms, killer. And everyone else is just doing their own thing. Lovely. Be nice if it was like, you know, faction wide, but never mind. You can't have everything. We've got commandments. Uh, I'm going to go with control. Let's have a look at provinces. Okay, you are fairly happy. Because this only gives, uh, it gives four. That's quite a lot. That, that's a fair wedge, isn't it? This gives control as well, so we'll do that. Once all the settlements are upgraded, we can always like switch out the growth buildings with churches, which do give. Wait, that gives that gives three. How much do chapels give? Also three, so it really makes no fucking difference. That would give us more patriarchs, though. Is that something? Uh, I, I don't right. I know I know you can build like the farm estates and the hallowed forests, and that helps the farms. But to be honest, it's a fifty percent increase, and the farms only make a hundred at max, so. It's only 150, so it doesn't really... 
makes more sense to build this, which is 200, and that's just one building. I mean, I guess you could... I guess if you really wanted to, but... I don't know. Meh. Big meh. Markets, that's where it's at. That's what he wants. Talking of markets, how much money are we making from markets? This is making 310. I mean... 307, almost 400 at max. It, it's... It's not great, but it's something, isn't it? Pingu, you're on your way. Good lads. Okay. First things first. Who owns this? Corone! Have we met them? Have we met them? Yes, we have. By the light of the lit... Why the fuck King don't you like me? Oh, you so don't like the Empire. Do you come to Bretonia? Well, I, I wanted a trade agreement, but if you're going to be shitty like that... If you're going to be a dick... I return. Okay, there. we'll come down here, we'll hit the Palace of Princes... All this gets upgraded... ASAP... So, Garrison beefing up, that's going to be enough to hold... So, basically, now we can kind of, like, hold that pass just with this city, and then we can come down here and, uh, well, we're also going to have to go over here and take out Sigvald. Who the f- where, I mean, I guess the Norskans own all of this. I wonder if we take some of this stuff and give it to Malekith. Maybe that'll work, but then that'll piss off the High Elves, so, I mean. Ugh, diplomacy, it's so hard. Okay, we're building stuff, that's all fine. Got Trek is just just chilling. I don't like the fact that Wolfric has got the little little cock ring icon there. I do like the seductive influence stuff. I, I, I should I should play a Slanesh faction again. I should play Nakari and get all the oh hello yes yes Catherine. I was going to give you a military alliance for nothing. Holy shit, Catherine's just going mad. She's she's on she's on one. She's get. Look, she's just retaken a whole bunch of stuff. Good going, girl. Well done. Yeah, what the fuck is she doing? Holy, holy... God damn, girl! God damn, look at you go. Nice work. That's it, retake the realm. Ooh, retaking the realm so hot right now. What? Would you like a... Greetings on behalf of the Empire. Wait, how do you feel now about Catherine? Here with a sheathed blade. Uh, have you literally just met your your neighbours? But you feel like you're fighting all the people they don't like, so... Sigma's will. I feel like a non-aggression pack could work. Ooh. The forces of Nangao cannot all abandon their post. For the defence against... For the defence... Love, I'm not the defence against Chaos. I'm the fucking... Whatever the opposite offense against that's the one. The opposite of defense is offense. <laughs> Good. We did it, everyone. Hear me roar. Okay, time to kill me some Norskans. I love me some Norskan scalps. Uh yeah, I think. I think just uh just a quick quick smash and grab. And then occupation. All right, we've got all of this, so we will upgrade Candy Mountain. I need air-conditioned catacombs as well. I could get one of you guys. We do have an ice witch, which is... I mean, she's not great. I'll level with you. Why do we have an Ataman? Oh, he's like the... Wait, can you recruit these guys? Really? Huh. Huh. I mean, you're not very good. So, I'm going to do another one, and we're going to see if we can get one that's better. -er. In the meantime, let's just get Darius. Darius? Darius? Darius. Hi. You hop in there for a minute, mate. You're just going to recruit some some box standard boys. 
Uh, more control or recruit rank control. Wait, do we have another? No, we got three of three of three so far. More control would actually be very useful. I'm having a bit of a rough time with the old, the old corruption right now. It's not the corruption. It's it's literally the fact that it's an unpleasant. Like pretty much all of my settlements are in, in an unpleasant climate. Which is not ideal. Okay, we'll build defenses and some of that. You are not. Why are you happy? Commandment is plus four. Yeah, no, that would make sense. Are you alright? Oh, you've got a thing. More control. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, what's the public order here? It's going plus one. Oh, we've got recruitment cost. In that case, uh, give me more money. Give me the money. How much money are we making across? Right, we're making two, two 2.2k in the blood, blood fire falls. Holy shit. Look at all that cash. Oof. I'm fairly sure a chaos door settlement can make something like a thousand just off one minor province. So, you know, be that as it may. Of Ursun. Mm hmm. I guess let's go with. Uh, I mean, that's attrition, maybe. The if we ever suffer, if we ever suffer attrition, world. at least we'll suffer less. And I really hate. Su Ul Ulrika, what what is a hero of the same type for you? I wish, I wish they had the same thing as like on the, because I, I have no idea if that will actually do anything. If it said active heroes, fine. But there's only one Ulrika, so I don't really understand what the difference would be. I'm not going to go for that because I don't trust it. And you're fine. Good. Giant Slayer. Got Trek. You're just doing your own thing. Got Trek. Do you want to go out to sea? You won't get any. You won't get any attrition there. For the ice court. Okay, we'll hop in here. Wolfric, are you? I travel the world seeking jewels. And the seven Today seas. You bring one to me. I am watching you through a cat. Wow, you're f you're f you're fighting a Zizel, and while he's away in the Empire, you're taking all of his stuff, which is interesting. That's an interesting development, isn't it? However, it looks I like you do sword. have a gift of Sanesh, so in inter interesting turnabouts. We don't know where Felix is, mate. Sorry. Best of the court. Uh, missile strength for Ice Guard. Potentially firing drills doesn't affect Ice Guard, which is oh, kind of a bastard. Okay, we'll go for, we'll go with best of the court. Yeah, exactly. Uh, we'll go evasion for you. And then we've spent all of our monies, haven't we? Silver. I wish I wish I had some way of spending devotion because. I don't. <laughs> Genuinely don't. They should have. Oh, they should have like the little um. You know how the uh, the chaos dwarves, dark elves have like provincial. What are they call buttons on the on the province dictats. Is that dictat. They should have those for devotion. Like spend some devotion that way. That would be good. You could like spend devotion on you know increasing your economy or going public order or whatever. Because at the moment, it's kind of useless. It's a resource the time generating. And in fact... Oh, hello. And in fact, it's... It's like... we we, It's almost like a special thing. Whereby we will gain it for having settlements in, in the Chaos Wastes. Unfortunately, that's not really helping us. Because we can't really use it for anything. Okay, there is Nakari. How's Nakari doing? He is strength rank 32. Skin proves how vulnerable you are. Does it? Alright. Still, it, it means that all the High Elves are currently still alive, which means we may be able to go and link up with them. That should be good. Let's go and grab the air con the air con catacombs. Uh, yes. Oh, we don't have to spend anything for colonization, do we? I'd forgotten about. Governor. Yeah. 
Yeah, baby. I follow the bear. Ah, the Fortress of the Damned is literally a hop, skip, and... Oh, look, Sigvold. Nope. No Sigvold. It's mine now. Thanks. Didn't reach in time, did you? It's Boris's now. Belongs to Boris. Absolutely not. No, it does. Okay, where else are you? You're over here. Right, so we just have to, like, smash these guys. And bish bosh bash, jobs are good. Oh, oh, gems. Yes, thank you. I don't want to do the right. Public order is oh, bad. Okay, let's do that because I feel like money-wise, actually, we're not in, not in, not in the worst place. I mean, we could go and raid Cracker Drag. How would how would one? potentially land Take here, like water. there. You're going to take Gotrek. attrition from that? Yes. Come on, Gotrek, you come and join us. The ice goes. Okay, we're going to take Cracker Drag for no other reason than I kind of feel like it. And also, it's going to do a bunch of good stuff. So, we're going to go Death Frost. So, the, the bunch of good stuff is going to be, because we've got a bunch of... So, we, if we raid Cracker Drag, capture a settlement, if we sack it and then capture it, then basically we should get lots of lots of stuff, which would be good. Oh, we got another one. Okay, we want you in the cold Myers. Wait. No. Which one were you? I don't know which one I put in. Fuck. Fuck. Who are you? Was that... Um, I kind of wanted you. Who did I put in there? Oh, I hope it was a good one. Oh, never mind. Okay, we'll go Tempest. You know what? I'm going to get another one of you as well. Going to get another one of you. Then we can go Draftsmaster. And ideally, we can then go Quartermaster. I mean, Lightning Strike may be a good idea, but I think we're going to go Quartermaster in Round of Fear because that's going to give us upkeep reduction. Holy shit. Nine and then another 8% I shall enjoy. upkeep reduction, which is going to make this army cheaper, which means that we have more money to spend on other frivolous things. Which I'm all about. I kind of, I mean, uh, okay, let's go pen. Ooh, evasion. Why is evasion red? I don't know. Doesn't matter. Not, not a big deal. Okay, we could get Pit of, I mean, Pit of Shades is always nice. Occam's Mind Razor is is reasonably reasonably good and more arcane conduits never never the worst choice Priest of the great orthodoxy yes indeed it can be no nope. that one okay we don't want you there because that is full of tentacles His and you're will be drowned. okay tell you what you come down here I mean, yes, you have seen a lot of a lot of tentacled bananas, so probably a good idea. Probably a good idea. Commandment here. What's the public order like? It is bad. Okay, in that case, that one. A little bit of Lord recruit rank. What are we doing this one? Oh yeah, we were getting text here so we could then get some of this stuff, couldn't we? So if we get that one, that's going to take four turns. And then we can start researching some of this shit, which is pretty nice. Income from all buildings, 5%. Yes, please. Anything Did Sigvald literally just run away? I can't see him. Good plan. I mean, he might be out. Oh no, there he is. There you are. Uh, tell you what, if we go like there. We've got agents who will probably be spotted. But, you know, we can, we can hope. I don't, I just don't think he's going to want to try and break through this. Let's upgrade all these bits. And then... Frost Weaver. K 
Can we raid it? Yes, we can. It is my duty. Come on, got track. Keeper of ice magic. Uh, okay, march. if you march, no that'll just give us a, get us a little bit closer. We can raid one turn, then sack it, then occupy it. Jobs are good. <sighs> Melee attack or range strength? I feel like missile strength is probably the best option. And you are going to be a ice. You're going to be an ice. I kind of hope Sigvald actually comes and attacks me. Like, where are you getting all this shit from, Sigvald? It cements my power. I demand absolute loyalty. Okay, um, what is your, what can you, do you have any, you don't actually have any special skills, do you? I mean, you get a war bear. But apart from that. We don't have anything we can, we can mash together. You can have a scarecrow banner. Have one of those. Have one of those. Have one of those. With Something this, like that. My rule is absolute. But I wouldn't say absolute. It feels like quite a strong statement to make. I mean, some more medicinal herbs. The fuck is the green knight doing over there? Orson loves all allies of King. Carl, trade agreement. Absolutely. Thought you'd never ask. Ooh, a little confederation there with any luck that will make them a little bit stronger. Okay, who have we met? Hello. Hello? Be sure you do not waste my time. No, I would never do that. For the fallen. Yeah, for those guys. Ulf, I will weigh what you have to say and the merit of your action. As you say. Good. Guardian of the What requests would you make of the Phoenix King? You're all friends, right? Yeah, you are. You can have some money as well, thanks. Wise indeed. Thank you. Thank you. Alaria. I am the bright flower of the goddess. Chosen She's... of Isha. She says this that she's wielding the sword of fucking Kane, usually. Good. Okay, trade agreements all round. Lovely. Oh, oh, look at that trade income. So good. So good. Lost Tsar return. Oh, sickers. Come here, you piece of shit. Come here. I want a word. I want a word in your shell like. My power blossoms. Liberate them from wealth. Okay, we're gonna raid. Tell you what, can Gotrek raid? Snuffling bundler. Uh, I'm sorry. Storm summoner. I'm sorry, sir. So, do we actually do we actually want to raid this? Is this actually useful? One thousand six hundred. Oh, I mean, it's something. Do I want ban? I guess, I guess. Yeah, no, okay. Uh, yeah, well, is this, I mean, Catherine has just gone off the chain, although I think she might have lost her army. The Tsarina bids you oh, shit. You would confederate with me. <sighs> do I want to do that? I mean, that's going to open up an entire separate front. I oh, know, her army's there. Will of the that is going to open up an entire separate front. Oh my god, she's taking fucking help here. Whoa, Catherine, chill. That, I'm kind of tempted to leave her to... I mean, I, I know it would help me. I know it would help with all of the settlements. But on the other hand, leaving Catherine to just curb stomp the Skaven... Oh, but it would give me access to their cities, wouldn't it? 
You know what? If it wasn't for the cities, I'd genuinely be like, just keep doing what you're doing. Our common cause shall benefit the world. All Kislev. Doing it. How much money am I losing? Oh, you know what? Nowhere near as much as I thought I would. <laughs> this is nice because it's going to give us more. More income from markets faction wide, which is like also you haven't built have you built you haven't built any of the special buildings, have you? I haven't built any of the special buildings. Um I feel like we kind of want to keep that. That seems fine. Okay, we can knock down wait, what's that building? Construction time. Um, what don't we want? Like, to be honest, all of this is good. All of this is good. Okay, but the Volker Palace definitely. The Grand Citadel would be nice. The Temple of Ursa would be good. The Imperial Embassy, I don't actually really need. <laughs> so we won't bother building that. We've got the markets though, which is great. Okay, you... Who, who do we have? We've got Grigor. Firing drills, best of the court. Pretty good. Lead renowned. I mean, I'll take it. It's fine. He's got some... Recent, he's got two... Two Frost Maidens with him who have... Stalker... Scourge of the Corrupt and Campaigner. None of that is particularly good. So never mind. You have... Ownership is Theft. Right. Uh, Economist. And Battler. Right, again, none of that is particularly good. But never mind. Catherine. What skills have you got, Catherine? Please let them be good. Okay, Firing Trolls is fine. Lead Renowned, I'm okay with. Guardian Call. Sure. I mean, it's, it's not the worst. And then a bunch of spells, which again is absolutely fine. Khan Queen is is pretty good. Indomitable. I mean, you just... Really, we just want to stack the Ice Guard with you. Because you make Ice Guard super fucking cheap. Okay, you hop in there a sec. I can't believe... How many... F the fuck? It's got a bunch of priests hanging around. The fact that we've managed to take Help It is kind of great. However, I suspect this is probably going to open up other problems for me. However, we have finally secured two of the three Kislev, Kislev cities, which I'm pretty happy about. Artillerists. Uh, yeah, sure, we'll have an artillery. We've also got you. Are you any good? If you're not, you're, you're, you're getting rid of uh, Builder... 20% oh, for all buildings. That may not be the worst choice. We don't really need the barracks here, do we? Like we could build the barracks anywhere. And as much as I like having the far the furs, there's better buildings to be built here. You know, income for all buildings 20% in the local province. Upkeep reduction for elemental bears and war bear riders. Yeah, so we don't want that. So we'll knock that one down. We've got another spare building there, which we can... We, okay, so we, as long as we've got two spare slots, that's fine. I think having the extra garrison there is a good idea. Um, I actually wouldn't mind the defences as well. Because that's going to give the tower projectiles. We don't realistically need that. Okay, we'll get rid of that one. I kind, kind of like having that there. Kind of like having that there as well. I need to get rid of something. It's going to have to be the... Okay, we don't need that. Right, so we can get rid of you. 
what buildings do we have here? So we've got the, the Magnus Gardens, which... Uh, debatable whether they're actually that useful. Global recruitment time is, is very good. That's probably a good one to have. The bleakness, upkeep reduction for Griffin Legion. If we've got war bears, we don't really need it, but you know, it, it's an option, so we could we could potentially do that. And then we've got this building here, which is fine. We just need to get uh Catherine, the ice guards. And currently we're not apart from a Zizel, we're not at war with anyone around here. Although that is that is very likely to change. But that's gonna have to wait until next time. So thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode.